Hello. In this video, I'm going to show how to convert the frequency counter in the Galaxy style radio. And it normally reads the five digits here. It's upside down right now, but that's 27355. Five. So that it reads 73350. What I'm concerned with is this last six digit that the frequency counter module in here does have the capability of displaying, but they only put a five digit in there. So you got a lot of movement in your fine clarifier in order to get that last digit to do anything. And the six digits really helpful on the sideband. So I'm going to show what I did on this module took these five resistors, shifted them over one hole, took this last resistor, made a new hole, that goes to pin 6 of this display chip, cut a trace, that goes to pin 5, moved it over to pin 6, like I did on this one, here's the resistors each now, Shifted over one hole with a new hole right there. Made my own jumper trace underneath. So I'll swap this in that radio and I'll show you what it does. Now, since I already know there's already a 2 ahead of the 7, now we're reading 273550. Now it's acting like a 6 digit freak counter. Since I don't need that 2, I already know it's going to be 2 always. Now I have a fine tune control. I can actually watch that 6 digit. It's nice because now I can go right where I'm sitting on the sideband. Just like that. That's how you modify the older style free counter modules for these Galaxy style radios. I'm going to do the same thing to this one. For some odd reason, this one came with all the IC numbers blacked out with magic marker. But I can see what those are just by taking a little rubber knock off to them. Of course, this one here got them all on it anyway. So that's it for this video.